hello to all my friends out there and so tonight we're having a little Monday munch out meal and so today I went to grocery outlet because I've been planning on uh, shifting over there to buy my food and uh, they had this for a dollar twenty nine which is a good price I, I think you get more lettuce here Grocery outlet, 129. I bought the tomatoes for um, one dollar at 99 cent only. And then you know I bought these items for a dollar. And then I'm making some peach tea, four cups water. This stuff is delicious. And then in my stockpile, I had this cookie mix, so I'll make some cookies. And then I want to make better a better rice. I spent, I don't know, quite a while doing better rice videos. But I'll cook the rice. I'll put taco seasoning on the rice. I'll add cheese and sun-dried tomatoes. So it will be better rice. And like when you're, you're going to eat rice, uh, you know, it's kind of blah. Uh, we used to eat it with milk and sugar ourselves. Okay, and then I started stockpiling these. Fajita, I try to make them meatloaf, uh, brown gravy, spaghetti. I buy them when I get them cheap. Chicken gravy, uh, you know, I get a really good recipe. Um, get chicken, dust it with flour, cover it with gravy, and bake 350. Uh, country gravy, you know, for biscuits. Sloppy Joe and brown gravy. Okay, so if you stockpile this stuff, like today I wanted some better rice. Voila! I just went to my uh, went to my stockpile. Uh, I'm not done with this stockpile stuff. Uh, you might be wondering why do you do that jewelry stuff? Well, it's because in the back of your mind, say if you ever lose all your money. It might occur to you to do a yard sale or a swap meet. Okay, now this is why I went to Grocery Outlet. First of all, I like that store very, very much, and I'll tell you why. A month or so ago, uh, they had a party for the community. Maybe two months. And, you know, they gave us chips, hamburgers, drinks, a DJ and I said well you know what why wouldn't I buy my food here even if it wasn't a really really great deal uh, you know who got me going here was Ricky and so uh, let's see these are about a little bit well it's a little bit more about um, two and two-thirds pounds meat but the thing about this is it's six dollars and uh, 99 cents so that comes up to about 87 cents let me see if i can show you i don't know if i can find my scissors let's see i can do well i'm gonna have to be primitive but it's in my nature anyway i want to show you the hamburgers in case you've never been to Grocery Outlet. So, okay, so tonight, one for me, one for my son. Now, there's no way anybody really should be eating, and you get eight of these. So if you have a Grocery Outlet, and you know, today there was a kid begging in front of the Grocery Outlet, and the guy came out and offered the kid a job, and I thought that was a you know, those are the kind of people I like to buy stuff from. Not people that give me a hard time, make my life miserable. Um, and I thought, you know, that that is really, really nice. You know, if that was my kid and uh, he was reduced to begging and, and somebody offered him a job, I'd be loyal to that store for the rest of my life. So if I see that store do that to somebody else's kid, wouldn't I be loyal to that store for the rest of my life? Um, yeah, I would. So, okay, grocery outlet. And not only that, you know me, I'm cheap. I wouldn't say this is cheap meat. I've had it, you know, at the party. 
and uh, I was planning on making my way over there but I had bought um, pounds and pounds of meat and I couldn't fit it into my freezer so I like 10 pounds ground beef and so as soon as I get room I'll just go to the grocery outlet boom and they have good deals on cheese which as you noticed uh, I buy this at Dollar Tree though I get a good deal uh, also if you don't have much money don't forget they have um, they have um, beef patty mix for a dollar I mean maybe you just don't have $6.99 so okay you guys God bless you all